the question is, what are side effects of vaginal progesterone? Now, vaginal progesterone is actually pretty popular because the other option is to take injections of progesterone, and they can be quite uncomfortable. But like everything else in life, there, there's a price to pay. And when you take vaginal progesterone, it's very common to have discharge and itching associated with that discharge. And so sometimes it's not clear if you're dealing with a yeast infection or if it's just your body's reaction to the progesterone suppositories. So that's something we look at carefully. If we think it can be a yeast infection, we treat you and we get rid of it. There are some women that have enough itching, enough discomfort because it's suppository that they have to stop it. But that's relatively uncommon. And related to this is the concept that recently a new technique has been developed involving vaginal progesterone. It used to be that all women took uh, injections of progesterone after the embryo transfer and through almost the entire first trimester. But the new technique is that you take suppositories for two nights and then on the third night you take an injection. So there's a dramatic drop in the number of injections that you need to take once you become pregnant. And uh, I, I like that. It's so much better for women and there's no negative effect to it. So it's definitely something to consider when you do your cycle.